Good morning. It is 11:41 in the morning right now. I am going to be filming my makeup routine today. Okay, so I do obviously think that the most important part of your makeup routine is your skincare. So I'm just gonna be showing you guys what I do for my makeup, and then because my skincare routine is like a whole nother video in itself. <laughs> it's like so much. But if you guys want to see how my face went from this to this i will gladly show you guys my skincare routine in another video but for now we're gonna go ahead and start with my makeup routine and this is just kind of like my simple daily makeup routine so we're gonna go ahead and get started i know that a lot of people start with their foundation first and then they do their brows afterwards but i like to start with my brows because i don't like any i don't like applying makeup on my brows like foundation on my brows so we're gonna go ahead and do that okay so the first thing that I use for my brows, the only thing I use for my brows is damn, this Anastasia Clear Brow Gel. And I just brush my brows and that's it. So I just do this. I used to do my eyebrows with the infamous, the dip brow pomade, which is this one right here. And I used to use this I used to use the medium brown before and then I started using the soft brown and then after that I started using the brow whiz in, in the shade caramel and then now I just do brow gel so it kind of went slowly de-escalating for me and this is all I do for my brows normally I do dry them with a little fan but mm, it doesn't have battery oh never mind I guess it does Oh, it doesn't have battery for the highest setting, but it has battery for the other two settings. We're just gonna let the, the highest setting turn off and then I'll turn it back on. Yeah, it's gonna turn off any second, but my brows are almost dry, you can feel it. But basically I just dry it out with the fan so that it stays in place and doesn't move while I'm carving them. So to carve them, to carve them I use my um, my uh, born this way foundation there you go i use the born this way born this way foundation in the matte line and it's in the shade snow i've been wanting to use this on like my whole face but if you guys hear noise in the background uh, my my boyfriend is cleaning outside so that's what that is but i've been wanting to use this on my whole face but i've been so scared to use this because this is so much more of a fair shade than this one is this is fair light and this is the one that i use on my whole face but i've been wanting to use this one but it's and honestly this one if i let it sit for a little bit it just doesn't budge anymore like it doesn't move so that's why i haven't been I, I don't use this one on my entire face but i do use it to carve out my brows so we're gonna go ahead and use this and then i just use the lid of my brow phrase because i don't use this on my eyebrows because it's too strong so then i just use i use a very small flat brush and i i like to basically like squ squish it together so that it'll stay flat and then i also use this kind it's also kind of a flat brush but it's um it's a little bit thicker so this one i use to blend out the makeup while i carve it out so i carve out half and then i blend out oh, let me just show you guys what i do so i'm gonna get a little bit on my brush here on both sides so i just get this much i go under my arch first and then I blend out and then I go under my with what with what is on this brush that I blended it out with I go under my like the rest of my brow so yeah that's what I do so just I'll just show you guys Okay, that is all that I do on my brow, quite literally. Okay, now I'm just gonna grab my beauty blender, which I already dampened, and I'm gonna blend it out so that it doesn't like just stay in a little blob right there. And I go ahead and do the other brow. So I'm just gonna carve out my other brow and I'll be right back. Okay, so now I'm done with carving out the under part of my eyebrows. Now what I do is I use my CC cream that I put around my entire face to carve out the top side. Basically, I start off with my tail here and then I start moving slowly in the little increments to the front. 
and then once that is settled I use my other brush again to kind of just blend it up so that that way the harsh line of the makeup doesn't just stay in the in my eyebrow area right there and and then after that I use my beauty blender to blend it all out and does, so that it doesn't look like it's just there okay and that's all I do for my brows I don't put any pomade or anything like any color into my brows anymore okay and that is it that is all I do for my brows now after I do my brows I am gonna start doing my foundation so I'm just gonna use the the makeup remover again to clean out the top of my Anastasia's brow phrase so we're gonna do that okay now it's all clean and I'm just gonna be putting it away Alrighty, so now for the rest of my face, I obviously use my Cosmetic CC Cream and it is in the color Fairlight. So um, what I do is I just grab the little pump thing right there and I just dab it all over my skin like this. A little dot and then a little line up there. And that's it. <laughs> So now I'm obviously going to be using my beauty blender and kind of just blending it around everywhere. Okay, and that's all I do obviously for my foundation. So I'm going to put this away. So I used to use, not, not too long ago, it just finished and that's why I don't use this anymore. But I haven't bought myself a new one. But I, I use this Smashbox Halo Fresh Perfecting Powder in this shade fair and I really like this one because you get fresh powder every time you know because well you twist it and then you get fresh powder every time but I finished it and I haven't used it but I don't want to throw it out because I'm gonna forget the shade I got and I really like this so I'm just I just keep it in my drawer for now I do have my elf perfect finish HD powder so we're gonna use this one it's in the translucent tra translucent shade so this is the one i'm gonna use and i'm just gonna use a big fluffy brush and just grab some of that product and then just apply it and i don't like to like brush it i like to dab it so that that way it's like pressing into my skin instead of it like just sitting like just sitting on top of my skin you know okay so that is that and honestly this is the only time i use powder and i like the only time i use setting powder and then after this like i don't use setting powder on top of anything which is probably i should probably put it on top of like everything else but i don't so that is going away my little sister gave me this and lately i've been using it i didn't use this before because i used to use only powder products but these are cream products so i wanted to see how they worked and then i started using it and i loved it so basically it has a, a it has a bronzer and then it has a blush and then it has a highlight so these are really really pretty colors i've obviously already used them but this is the what is this stack the odds sassy pants that's what it is so what i do is i used i use my contour brush this is a sephora brush i've had this forever but basically i use this brush and i grab the bronzer i use bronzer as contour which i know i probably shouldn't but i use it as contour so <laughs> we're gonna go ahead and apply it to my cheeks and kind of swirl it down like this and up and like that so this is the shape that I like to do so we're gonna do that on the other side okay so now that they're both set in place I'm also going to apply I was gonna say apply what the heck apply some on my forehead area so I just like to focus it mainly in the center and then I go ahead and grab some product and then I do it on my nose okay. and then that way it's like all just settled in so we're gonna go ahead and blend that out and that is what it looks like all blended out and now the next thing I do the blush so the blush this shade is so pretty you guys like 
so this this thing i just kind of rub it on my finger right here a little bit and then this is just how much i grab and then i just apply it along the contour shading right here the bronzer shade so we're gonna apply it right here going up and then i also like to apply one on the apple of my cheek like right there so that's what i do and then i like to grab like use whatever i have left on my finger here and just apply it at the tip of my nose And yeah, so that's it for my cream products. I'm gonna go ahead and put this away. All right, so I have my three products here, which is my Too Faced Chocolate Bronzer. I love this so, so much. I also have my NARS blush here. It's obviously very used, and it's in the shade Deep Throat. My Fenty Beauty Highlight. It's in the shade Hustle Baby which is a beautiful beautiful gold shade and i love this one so much on top of where i applied my cream bronzer okay and then i just blend it out and that is what it looks like so now we're going to do the other side and my forehead and then a little bit on my nose That's it for this one. Now we're going to go in with my blush. So I just go like this and let the little bit of product kind of just sit on there. And that is it for my blush. Now we're going to use my amazing, amazing Fenty Beauty highlight. And then just kind of brush it onto here like this. Just very light strokes. The Kovas palette. And it's called the Heye Lighter. I've obviously used this very much. The lid is now detached from the actual palette, but this palette is absolutely beautiful. I got it in my Ipsy bag. For my inner corner and a little bit of nose and Cupid's bow highlight, I use this clear, this more white shade. All right, and that is it my Tarte Lash Curler and curl my lashes. So we're gonna do the same thing on the other eye. Now I'm gonna grab my Lancome Hypnos Drama Mascara and basically use this. And I like using this on my bottom lashes. And that is the eyes all complete and then for my lips what i do is i first of all clean them up so uh, i use a um makeup wipe and then just clean up and then i just use my carmex on top of my lips and that's it and that is everything that i do on my face for my makeup watch out for new content coming soon so i'll see you guys in the next video bye